Now we talk about the pancreas. The pancreas is mixed exoendocrine gland, divided into th four parts. The first one is the head. The head lies in the concavity of the second part of the duodenum. This is the second part of the, of the duodenum. This is the concavity of the duodenum. And this is the head of the pancreas. The head of the pancreas have accessory part which is the ancinate process. This is the ancinate process. Lie behind the superior mesenteric artery and vein. Second part is the neck. Neck of the pancreas is the narrowest part of the pancreas which attach the head to the body and lies anteriorly to the origin of the portal vein. Third part is the largest one, is the body of the pancreas, starting from this part till the end of the main pancreatic ducts. And the tail of the pancreas, this part is the directed upward toward the hilum of the spleen. This is the part of the pancreas. Now the ducts of the pancreas. We're having two ducts. This is the main pancreatic ducts. This is the accessory pancreatic duct, which is situated superiorly to the main pancreatic ducts. The main pancreatic duct open into the duodenum, second part of the duodenum, via the major duodenum papillae, and the accessory pancreatic duct open into the second part of the duodenum via the minor duodenum papillae. The duodenum. Duodenum is the second part, uh, or third part of the guts, which is C-shaped tube, starting from first part, this is the first part, second part, which is lying vertically, third part, horizontally, and the fourth part. From the posterior view, this is the first part, second part, third part of the duodenum, and the fourth part of the duodenum. The mucous membrane of the duodenum. Except for the first part of the duodenum, which is a smooth mucous membrane, this is a smooth mucous membrane, the remainder parts of the duodenum folded into folds. This fold is called the 